Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. My name's PK and today we are going to be busting open 11 more packs of Champions Path. I went ahead and pulled these packs out of a couple double and pin collection boxes just because I wanted to just get some single packs opened up. These are the last of my Champions Path packs at this current time so who knows when, uh, when we will be seeing any more of these so I'm gonna go ahead and cherish these last few packs. And uh, we're just going to go into it, as always, guys. Be sure to subscribe if you enjoy the content I put out here on the channel. Uh, and, uh, and, yeah, let's just do this, man. Let's just do this. One, two, three, four, to the front. Come on. We need to. We need something spicy. We need something juicy. We need something glorious. UK, Schwa Blue, Ekin, Smacha, Nikki, Reverse Vulpix, and the dreaded, dreaded Scrappy. Alright, we press forward. So yeah guys, I hope you guys are doing good today. I hope you guys are doing good this week. Got the uh, got a new week here. Uh, I believe this is coming out on a uh, on a Monday. So I hope you guys are all enjoying your dreaded awful Mondays. They tend to be pretty piss poor for me. There's another darkness energy. Kabu, Absol, Beedrill. Come on, I just want one VMAX. That is honestly all I want. Just one VMAX. Give me one VMAX. Okay, well, we take that because I didn't have the Lycan Rock yet. Finally, who would have thought there are actually more than three hollows in this set? Not me. I only ever pull Scrafty, Hatterene, and, and my champ. One, two, three, four. Oh yeah, oh yeah, another darkness energy, that's like the third pack in a row, we've started out with a darkness energy. Come on. Is that a sign for that black charger? Nope. <laughs> nope. It isn't, unfortunately. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Seven packs left to go? Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? This code card, one, two, three, four, to the front. Oh yeah guys, and so I've actually just pre-ordered a lot of Vivid Voltage for anyone who cares to know. I ordered pre-ordered like four or five ETBs, a couple booster boxes, so I should be set on Vivid Voltage after Champions Path. You know, I kind of fallen out of the TCG a little bit, and uh, I was a bit unprepared for Champions Path to say the least. Another mod champ. Huh. But yeah, I was a little bit unprepared, and uh, I went ahead and dropped my pre-orders for Vivid Voltage a while ago, and I'm very glad I did. I don't think there's, you know, gonna be the same dilemma as with Champion's Path, considering it was a holiday set, and, you know, people love their Charizards. But either way, I wanted to make sure I had enough product to open up here on the channel for you guys. Rotom Phone will probably be giving away one or two of those ETBs away as well, so if that tickles anyone's fancy, be sure to keep your eyes and ears peeled out for that. Okay, Reverse Hollow Metal Energy and another Scrafty. Not looking too good, guys. We have not pulled even one thing yet. This is looking really rough. Really rough. Come on, man. Just give me something. We have not had good luck with Champion's Path. Let me just say that. Overall, it has not, not been the best. Hop, turf. Yeah, like, give me a hop full art. If it's not a VMAX, give me the hop full art. I love me a good trainer full art. Just give me something to work with. <sighs> Santa Scorch. Santa Scorch. And, I mean, as far as the hollows goes, I think that Lycanroc kind of, kind of topped it off for us. I don't think we really need. I can't get into this pack. I don't think we really need too many other hollows out of this set. I think we've pulled all of them. One, oops, two, three, four. All right, fist bump energy. Hopefully that's a good sign. Victini, that's a victory Pokemon right there. If we don't get something in this pack, then I'm I'm a bit worried about these next three. Okay, reverse hollow. Leaf Energy, and another Scent Scorch. So, oh man, oh man, we are down to three packs, three Gardevoir packs. Is there any way we can get the Gardevoir VMAX? That would be cool, because I have the V, I have the V4. If we could get the VMAX, you know, I wouldn't be absolutely pissed with today's opening. This is 11 packs deep, and we have pulled, I'm sorry, this is nine packs deep, and we have pulled nothing, nothing. Not a, not a single thing. Oh, I saw a little something something there. I saw, oops, saw a little something something there. So we got something. I think it's Hop. Maybe. Potentially. 
possibly Pokeball, Reverse Scraggy, and... Oh, nice! Yes! Oh my gosh, look at that centering. That is so bad. Oh my gosh, why is that the first thing I noticed? That's... Oh my gosh. Look at that. I mean, it is a full art pierce. It is the rainbow, so that is fantastic. This is a card I wanted, but... Oh man, Pokemon Company, you really need to get it together. You really need to get it together. These card quality is just terrible. A couple of the doubles I got, or not doubles, a couple of the uh, the Dreadnoughts I got from the pin collection boxes are just like bent to hell. Like they've got like that weird curve, like the banana curve or whatever. Like they're just, I, I hate it. It's so frustrating. The set, the quality of cards in this set is, from what I've seen, very piss poor. Uh, I mean, I'm assuming they were just kind of rushing this out. I know the Pokemon Company is working with about 30% staff, which is a big reason why... There's a Zygarde, which is a big reason why product was getting allocated, was because they just weren't able to meet, you know, all the pre-orders that were coming in and all that, just because of being understaffed. But jeez, man, the quality of these cards is brutal. Brutal. That's a really, really bad, bad centering on that full art. But that's all right. It'll still look good in my binder, nonetheless. Can we pull some last pack magic? Got a lot of fire going on. Fire energy, Victini, Kabu. Okay, is that can we can we bless that with a, with some more Mega Fire with that young Charizard? All right. Oh, okay, okay. All right, that's what I'm talking about. There's that last pack magic. Okay, so 11 packs, that's not bad. That is not bad. You know, I was a little salty. Those first nine packs were really terrifying, but we were able to bring it back in the end. That is beautiful, right on. Let me go ahead and sleeve these up and I'll see you guys in the recap. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is gonna wrap it up for today's Champions Path opening. Uh, considering I do not know when I will be getting any more Champions Path, uh, this is a nice way to nice way to end it off. Very nice, very nice. If I do happen to see any more Champions Path, I may pick some up. I may not. Um, I'm not really feeling this set too much. Uh, it was fun. The hype was nice. But uh, yeah, we did get some fire in today's episode. So if you enjoyed or you liked any of the pulls we got, be sure to show your support down below by destroying that like button, subscribing if you guys haven't already, and turning on those post notifications. Like I said, we do have a Vivid Voltage giveaway coming out shortly. Uh, I mean, at this time, the Charizard VMAX giveaway should be over, depending on what day this video comes out. So yeah, the Vivid Voltage giveaway should be coming out in about a week or so. So keep your eyes out. For, uh, for that, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.